another day, another dawn. Just hitting a little pre-trip, a thorough one. Car stand. She said it's fine, but it's a little, it's like right at men. Check our driving shaft, don't turn it too much. Leaf springs. Make sure ain't none leaking. And just go to the other side. Washer fluid. Sure, that's good, that ain't me in our coolant. Make sure it ain't no leaking. Just a thorough, make sure our belts not torn. That's good, that's good. And like she said, check our leaves. Leaf spring, you ball, make sure ain't none cracked. And ain't none leaking, just a thorough check, so we done with that. Courtesy pool. Same thing. Make sure it's underneath. Snap it on. Do a courtesy push. Uh, now we're just gonna hit the tires. Like she said, you should be able to feel for it. I will use my tire pressure gauge, but you said we've been using it. You know it push out air each time, but all our lug nuts, everything look good. These tires, you said you should be able to hear and know when it's a flat, all sound good. Lug nuts, everything into place. Let me check. Red on red, electrical line, safety, boom. Let me make sure our locking pin, king pin, still locked around the jaw, still locked. All right, back to checking the tires. Right. Okay, more flaps. Doors locked. sound good make sure that landing gear up lug nuts
okay, so we just made it back to the uh, Phoenix Terminal. It's about 8.30 here. So I drove like 10 hours. I actually been driving like a good amount of time. She even said it, like, I'm surprised you're not tired. Like I'm doing good driving. So I was able to drive in fog. Fog was crazy. Like I'm literally just watching the cars disappear. Like it felt like I'm gonna smack something or, you know, not see it cause it's foggy. She actually wanted to pull over, but I told her like, no, like, like I'm good. Like I, you know, I want to get this experience. Like I'd rather experience safety hazards or, you know, get that anxiety, my heart pumping with somebody that's, you know, at, like advanced, like, you know, trained, a trainer, then, you know, doing it by myself. And I don't hear nobody giving me no advice or anything. So that was cool. I did good with that. It was raining in Cali, like pouring down. I did good with that. Like you said, I felt like my driving, like I don't really struggle with that. And she even told me like, I should be proud of myself. So I was kind of excited about that, but that ain't really what I'm worried about. Not to say like in a cocky way or anything, but I get the drive. I understand not the tailgate and like definitely in the semi, like you said, safety is everything. But besides that, when we got to the dock, I already got two stories. I seen a lady, she was back and she knocked her whole mirrors off. This lady didn't stop. She didn't get out. She didn't even go pick up her mirror. She literally knocked, you heard it, boom. We drove past her mirrors on the ground. Then another, I told you we was going down the hill, you know, I guess people don't use their J's, I'm not for sure. But his trailer, his trailer started smoking and almost catching fire. Like, it's just crazy the stuff you see. But that was like the only exciting thing I got. I was just like, oh, damn, that's true. But I be using my J's. I actually love my J's. She taught me how to use my J's. Like, that's my go-to. Like, I don't even use my brakes. Like you said, the only time I was using my brakes is when I was, you know, going down the mountains because the J's was not kicking in fast enough. But besides that, it's Friday. We off. So, uh, getting a call. So, um, I won't be blogging over this weekend because, like you said, I'm off. So, I'm literally about to be hydrating and drinking hella water because I did not get enough fluids because, like you said, I'm a pissy person. So, I wasn't really drinking anything. Get some fluids. Get some nutrition in me. I need some fruit, some veggies, and uh, stretching, moving, working out. So, that's it for real. That's all I'm going to do. That's what my weekend going to consist of. So make sure you like this video. Make sure you drop some comments below. And um, please subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. So my hair, I got rained on. But whatever. But Trucking with Kayla is out. Peace. What's up, YouTube? So it's my off day, as y'all can see. I'm working out. Truck drivers, make sure you get that workout. I was even talking to a guy, and he was like, you work out? I was like, yeah, he said, you way better than me. He said, I ain't working out. I said, we need to, truck drivers. I know I'm young, but still, even when I'm 30, 40, my goal is to still be active, athletic. Like, come on, truck drivers. Make sure y'all get those steps in. It don't matter if it's squats. It don't matter if it's walking around your truck. It don't matter if it's push-ups. Go get that work in, man. I forgot to say this. Health is the new wealth. Seriously, not even joking. It don't matter truck driving, anything, y'all. Health is the new wealth. Take care of y'all bodies. Drink of trouble, CC. She said, Boogie real, no, I'm solid. I eat semen.
A shoe store in forever, but I just got me some comfy slots because I have been wearing gym shoes because that's all I bought. But I got these. All right, so I was in Leeds and it was a section that just kept saying the black five, five blacks. And I'm like, I actually want to Google it. it actually got a dope meaning and, and what it is. I'm gonna post it after this video, but it say the black five make history now, physical culture black five then they got the five black men this had dope though no cap a lot of details on it yes sir yay she <laughs> no cap i recommend these they mad squishy. Feel like you're walking on nothing. Go copy y'all some. First, we're going to begin in child's All right, what's up, YouTube? You got your favorite female trucker trucking with Kayla. So I'm just here to say happy Sunday. As y'all can see, today is my recovery day, so I'm not doing too much of anything. I did some yoga. I got two miles in on a bike. That's just to get my legs loose. So, and now, right now, I'm just about to hydrate and lay down and watch some movies. Just to enjoy this, you know, relaxation. So, I will be vlogging for next week. Monday, she said we will be doing local runs. But besides that, you know, I will update y'all, let y'all know what's going on. But make sure you like, make sure you comment, and make sure you hit that subscribe button right there. Trucking with Kayla is out.